Mark Hadmaker here. I've got Jimmy Classy Stevens. He's going to help me out. We'll talk a little bit about upright and do this off cage, off the wall, off of a parked car. We're talking about we've got a guy driven back. We don't necessarily want to stay in an over under clinch till we get him driven because he's got more chances to get reversal there. So if I've got an over under, I actually want the under. I'm actually on the far side. I would rather have said this. I want to get in the elbow and get down to wrist control. So I've got under hook high on the shoulder wrist control and my shoulder would be driving through my head is in also he can still step out i put a knee on him at the same time so that's my press control from here i'm going to look to hit a cross face which is driving this across give an elbow that's not enough if he drops for a break but i don't trust it he's i've now put him in range to start grabbing the leg and that's why one elbow and then right back into wrist control i could do this multiple times but i don't want to do bang bang with the elbow i'm going to hit with the elbow Reestablish control, assess, see if we want to run on with the takedown from there. Lots we can do from there. The main, make sure you've got it controlled when he's pushed on the uh, cage. So, underhook, wrist control, knee control, cross face, he's still getting driven down the cross, elbow, right back to that uh, position of control. Got it? Wait a minute, it's safe, brother.